gonna do a little unboxing kind of review quick video thingy uh, this is a package from NF strike I have won a contest on Facebook to uh, give me um, some fa a fest mag um, and I turned them you know asking my information process I said hey uh, I'd like to see maybe I can get some you know some darts or whatever uh, for my Nerf club. Um, we need some, and I'd hate for you to send a small package and you know waste all that you know time and, and kind of help us out a little bit. So they went ahead and set me up. Um, unfortunately, uh, I have children who like to open packages, so I already know what's in it. But we're gonna go ahead and kind of reveal it real quick. Um, so we've got the opened. Fast mag, we'll get to that in a second. And they hooked me up um, with some darts, which I was really happy about because our Nerf Club is kind of new, so we don't have a lot of you know communal darts. And these are going to be great for that. So it's not a whole lot, but it's, yeah, it's 300. So 300 darts. It's always really good. Um, they are the AccuFake Red Tip. Um, seem pretty good. Um, yeah, I like them. Nice, nice, good construction. I thought they were gonna be good. So we're definitely gonna have uh, have to use these for our next war, which is this Saturday. I'm really excited. It's our second one, so we'll have some fresh darts for use of that so that out of the way now onward so the fast mag i already have a couple i love them i use them on a drop leg that i received a while back um depending on when you see this video you'll see the review i have for that um, I went ahead and put them together because that's how I run them and I want to see how it reacts to connectives. So um, I'm going to go ahead and test out how it feels with other things and then I'm going to actually compare it to what I already have. So um, comparing it to uh, regular 18's uh, Nerf. Um, they are, this is the first time, I mean, I know you probably won't believe me if some of you, but, but yeah, this is the first time I've done this. Um, they're, they feel good. Um, they're tight enough. I'd say the back one is tighter than the front one. They're tight enough to hold it. Um, if you're holding it straight up and down, maybe upside down, it might fall off, but um, no, I mean, they're good. Uh, little NF sticker. We'll put that right there. They're not a sponsor or anything. This is supposed to be up with free stuff. Um, so I like it. I I always wondered if I could put another one in the front just to see, but I feel like that may be too much of weight. So yeah, um, 18s work well. These are actual 18s that are knockoffs. Um, so. I got an idea how they feel. Now that's actually what I do run is these. Um, let's see if that was. So, yeah, they seem a little, a little different. A little, not as strong, but it's strong enough to hold it in there. I will say, yes. I mean, it's a good, good fit. Uh, Nerf 12s, which, I mean, I don't know if you would actually run these with 12s. I guess maybe if you had them on around your waist, uh, you could run them. Um, I have noticed that the orientation of them um, really matter sometimes. Uh, so, this one actually is a 12 that was a flip thingy, and this was just a regular 12. And I've noticed that they have a little bit different feel to them. But, uh, yeah, good and tight. And the last set is going to be, these are from Light Take, uh, from another contest that I won. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, they feel good in there, too. I like it. Actually, a little more snug than 
the Nerf. Yeah, they're actually tighter, which I mean I think it's good. I think it's good to have these because if you run, but see like if they're flipped that way, yeah, I've noticed that if they're flipped where the notch is to the left, facing left, it's not as, it doesn't feel as good. I don't know. Maybe it's just the way I put them in there. Uh, but they're supposed to stop right there and not go any further. Hmm. And it seems a little, a little stretchy, like the material of this. I'll show you in a second. Um, now my goal of this is to run it with a stick in the back and a drum in the front and actually wear this upside down um, on my left hip because that's what I'm, I'm hoping I can use it for. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that or not. Um, it does come out. But, I mean, I don't know. I, I, like, to, I like to use it. That's what I wanted it for. I might try to add some rubber bands like Captain Xavier did or said to do. I don't know if he did or not. Um, yeah, if you notice, the drum has to get fixed, but it will. Uh, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm curious on how that's going to, to play out. Uh, I can't wear it up, but it's very, very heavy. Um, so I may not be able to do that. But that's what my goal was, is to wear a drum on the hip. But if not, I'll just leave it with the sticks um, facing upward and run it like that. So onward to comparing it. So I'm going to put this here. And I'm actually going to go ahead and attach it to this little fella. So this is my new drop leg pa uh, platform. You may have seen it in a video. I'm pretty excited about it. Um, so we're going to go ahead and attach this to here. Um, just to get an idea how it compares to something else that I have. So we're going to go ahead and, and I have noticed that these straps, they're very bungee, very stretchy. Uh, not, not, you, not, not, I'll show you, I'll show you. So I'm going to go ahead and just put it through here, um, while we're doing this, make sure to like subscribe uh comment get notified on all the stuff for my channel i'm having some new stuff coming out i'll have some war videos uh footage from saturday coming up soon after the war is done i've got a uh, couple mods working in progress i've got new parts from foam blast that just came in last week and i'll start putting those together for a little build I'm doing, so just be on the lookout for that. So I will say this, that the the rubber is very, is very rubbery, uh, lack of a better term. It do, It's not a strong rubber. It's very easy to come off. Um, this may even have to be... Uh, next to each other it may not be able to be on top because of the, the the weight because if you can see this I'm trying to show you the, the band inside is actually going in an awkward kind of direction so that material really has to be strong now I'm going to put this right here so you see that one, and I'm going to show you what I already have. Now this is another drop leg that I already run. Um, and it looks very, very similar, but there is a few differences. Um, and the first one is being that the, the, the rubber is much harder. Um, it's, it's a different style. Um... I don't know if I can even show you the comparison. Yeah, definitely a thickness difference. Uh, let's just take this off. And I'm not going to take this off because they're very hard to get on and off. So I can tell you. And screw it. We'll do it. All right. So look, I can just show you the difference. 
Just buy that. Sorry, hold on. There. That's the difference, is that this one came from Amazon. Um, and the, the rubber is just a different thickness. You can tell by the indentions right here. And that's going to play a big part in its longevity. I can tell just by that. Um, also, the rubber seems to be thicker on this side than this side. Um, the, plastic, the, plastic, the plastic seems exactly the same. Um, oh, okay, hold on. I didn't even notice this. So inside, there is kind of a... Inside there is kind of a grippy plastic. Uh, this one does not have that. So again, this is the light take one. Uh, and this is the Amazon one. Uh, they're about twice the price, um, from what I understand. But it, it's really almost the same as that thing, except for the main part, which is this rubber... Uh, is very different. I mean, that's just the most notable thing I can see. It's just that part. Um, the thickness of that rubber is key, and that's what holds it together. Um, and I mean, I, that's why I feel comfortable, you know, running these with 18s um, and just going to town. I mean, they they are great. Um, I'll put that together later on. So yeah, um, I mean, I'll probably just run this side by side on my belt just. Because the rubber does, is not, the material is just not there. It's just not, the flimsiness is not what I want. Um, I want something a little more sturdier. But I think with one, I think it'll be fine. Um, I will say this though, that the rubber, this rubber is much easier to feed through. Um, because of its flexibility, I guess I'll say that. So, I mean, look, I got it. That was easy. That was quick. Now, if I go to do this, I'll just show you. If I go to do this one, I've got to actually kind of go through this. And it's going to be awkward when I'm trying to keep it in, in frame. It's You almost have to actually... Do it... It's 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 hard. It's difficult. So this one is harder, but it's good because that's the rubber. It's it's stronger. So, um, I mean, I, I appreciate the item because it was a gift. It was a it was a prize. But I'm also doing this as a review because some people may purchase these from Light Tank, um, and I want you to know what you're getting because I was very curious on what they were going to be like because I already had some. So that's my review. Um, I'll you put it to use on on Saturday to let you know how this works out. I'm also using this platform and stuff right here for a rival loadout, so you'll see that kind of stuff too. But anyways, um, guys, thanks for coming out to the channel, uh, watching it, the review. Uh, a link will be in the description down below for this product. Um, and I may Maybe even the other one, I, I don't know. I, I know I'll put one for this just because I want you to see where it's from, what it's all about. Um, but anyways, uh, thanks for uh, watching. And as always, guys, Nerf on, Nerfers.